How do you make a bar graph? Think about this question during the lesson. Greg made a table to show the amount of money he saved each month. Use the data in the table to make a bar graph on grid paper. A bar graph can make it easy to compare data. First, write a title for the bar graph. What should the title be? The title of the bar graph should be Amount Greg Saved Each Month. Choose the scale. Decide how many units each grid line will represent. What does a scale in a bar graph mean? A scale shows the units used in the bar graph. What units are used in this bar graph? Each grid line represents $10. Set up the graph with the scale, each month listed in the table, and labels. Then draw a bar for each month. Why is it important that the label to the left of the scale numbers be there? It tells what the numbers stand for. What are the labels for the categories and where do they come from? The labels for the categories are January, February, March, and April. They come from the month column in the table. How do you know how long to draw each bar? Each grid line represents $10. Look in the Amount Saved column in the table for each amount. You now can make a bar graph from information contained in a table. During which month did Greg save the most money? Try finding the answer yourself.